Hey guys, welcome out to Villa Rica. Beautiful new home community out here. About to do a tour for you. Freshly laid down the side on this one. I think this is going to be 357. Taping this in August of 2024. Looks like it's going to be a wooded lot. Let's see how they lay it out. This is west of Greater Atlanta. It's a beauty, right? They have slab and basements from 300s, about mid threes, to finished basements in the fours. <laughs> I just did a video tour of one that's like 458 with a six bedroom finished basement. This area is nice because you could do like a swing bed, uh, rocking chairs. All right. See what we got. I just met with the on site agent. They were like begging us to come out because you know they love our home tours and how we always bring some amazing qualified buyers. So now it's your opportunity when you see the home tour. Let's walk this is the first time I'm seeing it, so I'm gonna give you my honest opinion. Very rarely can you get a price in a four or five bedroom nowadays for a payment with a two in front of it, basements with a three, low, low threes, like 3,100 because they're buying down the interest rate. I'll give you all the details of that as well. But a great foyer area here. You got baseboards, outlet, so you could do an amazing art gallery here or console table with lamp. Put Lay out some magazines, your little mint trays, things like that. Uh, but a really cool uh, entranceway when you first come in. Over here, I love these doors too, the design of them. Very modern farmhouse chic. Hang up your um, jackets there. This is what's called a powder room. And things I'm looking for where they're not like cutting back because usually at these price points are like, okay, you're gonna get like apartment grade stuff. Nope. Got the Revwood floors, L LVP, got the White cabinets, granite and brushed nickel, LED light. So really nice with a window, nice powder room for your guests to use. And again, coming back to the foyer, we enter into the dining and family room area. So let's break this down. Wow, this is pretty big. Or we could just make this into a gigantic family room. So let's talk about different ways you can do it. Number one, it comes with the uh, electric fireplace. Um, so you don't, these great thing about these electric fireplaces, if you like them, you like them, they're throwing them in. If you don't or want to do a different style, you could literally could just take it off the bracket and then design the room how you want to. So say you wanted to do like this whole room as like, um, your family room, like media center or something like that, you know, and do one of those huge electric fireplaces. You could, you know, make it here. Um, so very, very cool but if you wanted to keep this type of layout and put your tv above it you know you put a nice couch here and you could do a sectional like along here or you can do um you know couch here a couch here and like an oversized chair a little coffee table and then you could formally make this into your uh dining room area because it has the led light you could switch this out to a chandelier if you wanted to Another idea, sometimes people love like um, a cocktail area, like you could do an amazing build out bar or you could do a build out bench like along here and do a nice table. You could do a pool table if you wanted to over here. And again, if you wanted to just make this into a gigantic family room, um, you could just center it right here. And like I said, just put your, we have somebody that can, you know, hide the wires there. You can even do like a little piece of artwork if you wanted to on both sides. Like a library light, a library light, piece of art, piece of art, TV here. Just ideas for you. You also, if you wanted to like make this area the family room, and make that into like a dining area. Just an idea, you could do your flat screen TV here. Do a nice long couch long couch where I'm standing, oversized chair, and then put your, uh, change out this light to like a uh, chandelier. And then you got a nice long table. And now you have a dining room with that ambiance of 
uh, the fireplace. As you can kind of see, you're gonna have a beautiful wooded backdrop. I think they're watering in the grass, so I might have to, I wanna get my camera wet, but I do wanna show it to you. So as you can see, this is a fantastic backyard. Um, they're, they're putting the sod down here. Uh, this is actually one of my favorite yards that I've seen in a while because you got the tree buffer. It's probably like an easement. Property line probably goes right to the trees. As you can see, the when we go upstairs, we'll see if we, there's a window we can look out. Um, but your fence right there. But they give you all covered back porches, which is fabulous as well. You all come with window screens and blinds. And then here is your kitchen. And we were talking about, like, if you don't feel like the need for a formal dining area, this could be, like, a nice circular table. You could do a long one, too, but I probably would do a circular here. You have the peninsula, granite countertops, easily three seats right here. Again, we'll kind of take a little peek out here to show you the covered back porch. See how it's getting wet, so I don't want to get my camera wet. But this is fantastic. If you build from the ground up, you know, you could pick out backsplash if you wanted to. Um, sometimes people don't like the designer selection in the, for the builder, so they like to find it at home, uh, was it Floor and Decor, obviously Home Depot's Lowe's, but if you like one of their selections, you can pick it. Um, this is where your refrigerator will go. This is where you come in to the garage. Get a little late here. And see if we can get garage door openers included as well. Two car garage. I like the exterior blue paint too, that was nice. Countertops here, so if you wanna do your Keurig. Now they have different collections for kitchen. You could do the double ovens on the wall units. This is their standard option. And like I said, I think this one's about 357. They're gonna buy your interest rate down for the month of September. I'm taping this in August of 2024. You know that pricing and incentives have changed. They sell two or three of these, they're gonna jump the price up 10, 15,000 and lower the incentives. So take advantage of it. Microwave, five burner gas, I mean, uh, excuse me, electric stove, black and stainless steel oven, I like the stainless steel down on the warming tray. Your pantry, cabinets, plenty of cabinet space and a dishwasher, the oversized sink. Not, again, the apartment grade. This is, this is really nice at this price point. Oh, very cool. That's nice right there like that. Brushed nickel. Closet added storage. This is great too. So if that pantry wasn't enough for you, you wanna maybe create like a little additional storage space in here or dog food, cat food, stuff like that. All right, let's head up the staircase. You got the wrought iron with the wood banister. Um, $2,500 is the earnest money. That's it. Whether you build or buy one of their standing inventory. Might be a little bit more if you want to kill it with upgrades. You know, you might have to put like a 50% deposit down on something like that. But threes and fours is crazy. Washing machine, dryer wire rack, but you could also do um, cabinets after the fact. Got an outlet here too, which is great. These are things that I've probably filmed literally three to 4,000 out, three to 4,000 home tours in my career. So I look for all these type of things, baseboards, extra outlet for your ironing board. Ooh, look at this. Wait till you see when I turn the corner. Big room here, queen or king. I'd probably do a queen with two nightstands, dresser, flat screen TV. A uh, closet. Take a little bit more look at this backyard. This one's available, like I said, this is a great lot. So you can kind of see how fenced in backyard is. You can see they added some solar lights. I like the lights where you put it, like have it hardscaped. I mean, um, hardwired. You, know, you could do solar on the top too. You can see, guys putting in the uh, the side. This is Bermuda side with the covered back porch, and every one I've noticed has a covered back porch, which is something again you don't see with a lot of standards for the builders. They give you a lot of standards. All right, I think this is gonna be the primary, so we'll finish off. 
Look at this. Wow, look at all that wrought iron. Might even want to change this out to a nice chandelier. But this is the loft space. So when you don't have the basement, your basement will depend on your price point. It's going to be about a hundred thousand, about seventy-five thousand to a hundred thousand dollars more. If you're capped out around a pre-approval of three sixty, maybe three eighty with the rate buy down, because rates have been hovering around six percent, so that's a huge savings bringing it down to 4.99 plus they'll pay a good portion of your closing costs. Current incentive I think is $10,000, um, which should cover almost all of it at this price point. But you can do what we've talked about in other videos. Um, you could build this out to like a home office right here, like build out a desk, put a little wine or a beverage center over there, put a TV above and then where I'm standing, wrap it around. I mean, imagine doing a great couch right here or two rows of movie theater seats uh, or like a sectional along here, putting like a stand up popcorn machine or something. And now you have a multifunctional home office slash media room and you just saved almost $100,000 for having a basement because I love this wood a lot. Closet. Better number two. We saw the first one when we got to the top of the stairs. Again, king or queen, probably do a queen. Another view of this backyard. Closet. I love walking out to that. Granite. See, these are things I'm looking for. Brushed nickel, double lights, mirror, redwood floors, tub shower. If you build from the ground up, you want to just make this a fully tiled shower. Um, or tile around the bathtub, you can do that as well. This is where you get all this extra incentives. If you're a firefighter, truck driver, medical professional, EMT, police, I think you get an extra $1,000. Another queen size bed. So you're potentially looking at anywhere from 21000 or 11,000. If you do the 4.99, you'll get 10 to 11,000. If you don't do the 4.99, they'll give you about 20 or 21,000 to use how you want. Some of the best deals I've seen this year here at the uh, second half of 2024. All right, the primary suite. So you get the ceiling fan included. And then you could put your king size bed here or queen two nightstands, your flat screen TV, and then you have this little inlet. So you could do a small love seat, oversized chair if you wanted to. Got a couple outlets to work with. So say you want to put a nice chair here, kind of create like a little sitting area. Look out your front door. Again, you can see kind of style of houses. Really, really nice. And then the primary bath. Look at these. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. The lit up little area for like a little makeup bar if you wanted to. Put like a little chair underneath, a little bench. Granite countertops, rectangular sinks. Tub shower combo. You could do a nice valance here. You could frame it out with glass. Nice size walk-in closet with the window. You're going to build this out after the fact, depending on what your needs are. Ooh, towels and linens. Or if you don't feel like you need a towels and linens, you could do another custom type of closet, a shoe closet or something like that. Toilet closet, separation door. Very, very nice. So if you guys are interested, go to greathomesatl.com, hit get pre-approved, have the Zoom consultation. Can I give you any information unless you want to be a part of the family? We have to establish a buyer brokerage agreement. We'll talk all about it on our Zoom consultation. Do not skip any steps. Send us over your pre-approval or hit get pre-approved at greathomesatl.com. You'll get all these incentives, whether it's this community, any community in Greater Atlanta, resale, commercial, residential, townhouse, single family. We got you. Just please, please, please follow the process so we can establish the relationship and welcome you to the family. This is Villa Rica, Georgia, guys. Talk to you soon.